everyone today we are going to start the english course from the book snow white class 8 by mayang chen we will start the course by the first chapter a drop fell on the apple tree this is a poem written by emily dickinson let's start a drop fell on the apple tree another on the roof a half a dozen kissed the eaves and made the gables laugh. A few went out to help the brook that went to help the sea. Myself conjectured were the pearls what necklaces could be. The dust replaced in hoisted road, the birds jacko sung, the sunshine threw his hat away, the orchard spangles hung, the breezes broad dejected and bathed them in the glee. The East put out a single flag and signed the feet away. So this was the end of the poem. Now we'll underline the hard words and write the meanings side by side. So the first word is eaves. It is in the line a half a dozen kiss the eaves. Eaves means the part of a roof that meets or overhangs the walls of a building. The next word is gables. This word is in the line and made the gables laugh. Gables means the triangular upper parts of a wall at the end of a rigid roof. The next word is brook. It is in the line a few went out to help the brook. Brook refers to a stream. Stream as in a small river. The next word is conjectured. It is in the line myself conjectured were the pearls. Conjecture का मतलब होता है किसी चीज़ को guess करना. अगर आपके पास आधी information है किसी चीज़ के बारे में आपको completely पता नहीं है कि वो क्या है, तो आप अगर उसको conjecture करोगे उसका मतलब है कि आपने guess कर रहा है उसके बारे में. The next word is hoisted. It is in the uh, line the dust replaced in hoisted road. Hoisted का मतलब होता है राइज करना किसी चीज को रोप्स या फिर पुलिस की हेल्प से रेस करना द नेक्स्ट वर्ड इज जॉकोस इन द लाइन द बर्ड्स जॉकोस संग जॉकोस मींस प्लेफुल और ह्यूमरस द नेक्स्ट वर्ड इज ऑर्चर्ड इन द लाइन द ऑर्चर्ड्स पैंगल्स हंग ऑर्चर्ड्स आर अ पीस ऑफ इनक्लोज्ड लैंड प्लांटेड विद फ्रूट ट्रीज in the same line, the next word is spangles. Spangles mean small, thin piece of glittering material, typically sewn as one of many on clothing for decoration. So you know all the glittery clothes you have, उसपे जो glittery चीज़ है जो sequins लगे होते हैं, उनको spangles कहते हैं. The next word is dejected. In the line, the breezes brought dejected. Dejected means sad or uh, dispirited or depressed. The next word is bathed in the line and bathed them in the glee. This word means to wash or take a bath. In the same line, the next word is glee. Glee means great delight or pleasure uh, from one's own good fortune. The last word is feet. It is in the line and sign the feet away. Feet means a public function held outdoors uh, and it is organized to raise funds for a charity. Or uh, there is another meaning of the word. Uh, it is a celebration or a festival. So this was the end of the hard words. Now.